Uh, hey, what's up, guys? This is the DJ Waffle one with a pretty big unboxing for you. It's the Logitech uh, performance mouse. It's the pr pretty much the newer version of the Logic, uh, the MX Revolution. It's you know a little bit different, but I'll get to that and maybe in another video. I think one of the differences is the color. There's like a silver. I'll get into it later. So you sort of open it like that. It's pretty. It's really really cool because it like pretty much shows you the product. So you sort of really know what's gonna what what you're gonna get. So it shows the mouse itself and the uh, receiver. Very small receiver. Smaller than the MX Revolutions, which is a big difference. So you just open that. Lift up, and you get the mouse and receiver in this sort of plastic thing. <laughs> There's so many unboxing where people sort of have trouble with it, so hopefully I don't. This is so cool. I've really, really wanted this mouse for a long time. I was um, contemplating between the uh, this, the MX Revolution. And the Magic Mouse that just came out. I mean, at Best Buy, this was 80, 88, my mom said, plus shipping. So it would pretty much be like a $7 difference between the Magic Mouse and this. And this seems more comfortable. It has the four buttons. And, I mean, just, it really, it looks, I think it looks better than the Magic Mouse. I mean, I'm really, really going against my Apple ways. But this is just a great mouse. I've used it before in stores, and my friend has it, so I've tried it, and it's just it. So, oof, let me keep on going. And this piece comes out, and you get sort of like a folder. But here is, hmm, it's sort of like a pouch. Let me get to this last. This seems pretty cool. So, this slides out, and you get your control center for Windows. You get your, your user guide. Um, seven power tips. Uh... I don't know, but this, here's a MacBook and a uh, cinema display. It shows some features. And then, for this case, I've heard about this, but I really, I just heard, I heard about it briefly. I didn't really know why Logitech was doing this. So, this pouch, you can zip it. And you get a USB to mini USB cable. Mm, nice Velcro. I might have to use this. And you get hmm, a Logitech USB charger. Wow. This looks really nice. And then you get a. Uh, Oh, you get a USB extender. I mean, you get a lot of extra things in this. And you get the pouch. But actually, <laughs> it's really funny because I was thinking about getting a the uh, Apple iPod charger, the wall unit, but I don't need it now because I could just use this. So, let's see. Let's take this out. The actual mouse. Let me first get the receiver. Best thing for last. Oh god. I'm already starting out bad. Oh. Didn't even have to cut it.
Wow, this is really small, guys. This is... What do I have? What do I have? Compared to... I don't have anything to compare it to. Okay, here is the actual cable. USB cable. And the receiver. That's a pretty good comparison. So, now let's get to the actual mouse itself. I have to admit, this thing is actually pretty big. Okay, let's see. How do you get this off? I'm gonna drop it. Uh oh. Oh. Ah. There it is. Wow. This is amazing. This is great, guys. So you have your your scrolling, power scrolling. You have mini USB. Oh, <laughs> this is great, guys. This is like a charge and play kit for your Xbox 360. If you run out of battery and you still need to use your mouse, then you just plug this to the front. And it charges. So thanks for watching this unboxing. I'll, I'll have a review up soon. So thanks for watching. Uh, comment, rate, and uh, subscribe. Thank you. Bye.